Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the chat. I am your host, Ublink. We are here today. Listen, tell them who you are, guys. Let them, let them know who, who I'm talking to right now. Go ahead. Hey, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. It's Wanston. And I'm Leo. And we're the House of X. Nice, we're nice. entertainment company. Yes. Yes. So like any good superhero, what's your origin story? How do you guys get started? How did House of X come to fruition? Ooh. Okay, well. That was um, many, many, many years ago. Yes, back in 2008. Originally, House of X was a drag house because I was performing at the time. And as the years went on, I took my company with me and I won pageants. Um, me and Watson reconnected because we kept passing each other in life. We reconnected in 2013, and then Watson had an idea to take the drag house and turn it into an entertainment company, and that's how we got here. Yeah, so now we are an, an entertainment, entertainment company. company. We, we give been. you entertainment on a broader standpoint, whether yeah. if we're going to a convention, we're going to a show, or we're going to perform for you on stage, yeah. or just promote an event. Okay. That's basically mm -hmm. what we do. Yeah, awesome. we used to um, host our own drag shows back in 2015. Uh -huh. Yeah, nice, nice. And like we joined uh, YouTube in 2018. Yeah, like yeah, right before the pandemic hit. Yeah, it's been an amazing ride. We got to meet a lot of different people. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, so tell me a little bit about like the people that you promote, like your entertainment company. So mm -hmm. what do you represent? Is it just mainly you two guys, or your business, or do you have clients? What? How? How would like young people that are looking for a place? that house of x represents such as yourself how can they like get in contact with you what are you looking for for people in in the community um, well if they're looking to book us let's say for an event mm -hmm. as performers okay they can reach out to us on our instagram mm -hmm. um our all of our social media platforms are house of x ent mm -hmm. or they can just email us at um house of x at info at house of x com. Mm -hmm. and you know just put in the subject inquiring about booking for an event mm -hmm. whether if it's you know for us to live stream the event or you're booking one of us or both of us mm -hmm. to perform Mm -hmm. You know, let me just specify that comes with a booking fee. <laughs> <laughs> okay. you know? All right. So, so um, I think they would know that. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, so like, how? What got you started? Like, like I know how so X came from the the, the drag you, scene, the drag yeah. scene mm -hmm. but what got you into that? Like, what made you want to start doing that kind of of uh, showcase? Okay, drag? Well, let me be specific yeah, yeah, yeah. so people yeah, don't get confused. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I'm a hip hop thing. dancer. Yes. Um, at the time, I had a boyfriend. And yeah. led me to the club, and that's how I got into the drag scene. Nice, yeah. And, so yeah. I was able to use my skills um, in their field. So hip hop yeah. dancer, I know you're an author. Yeah, um, right? yes, yes. I'm yeah. currently yeah. an author. Yeah. When Leo, when we had got together, and mm -hmm. I saw what Leo was doing mm -hmm. as a hip hop dancer in the art of drag scene. Yeah, I was like, oh, this is cool. This is something different because you know when you are in the LGBT world, you just yes. used to the ballroom. Yes. You're not, you don't see anything else. I mm -hmm. am from an island, so I didn't know that they actually have the performances f that the guys can get involved. Yeah. I only yeah. knew, you know, the guys get into gowns and dresses yeah. and all that different type of stuff. The pageantry. So, and yeah. Like yes, so yes. when I saw it, I, of course, I was like, oh, I want to do it. <laughs> and then we can flip it and do this together. Yeah. You mm -hmm. know, so after I, showed after i showed them i said this is the idea i have let's create our own show be the promoters of our own thing because there weren't no one doing it because mm -hmm. see mm -hmm. the females are always the one that would provide the show for other females to come and perform yes that's yeah. the sure. guys mm -hmm. you know they would oh, ask, male performers. yeah male performers <laughs> will ask a female that they know that is a friend to come and perform at their show okay the guys yeah never had their own show so basically we ran a show for about maybe two and a half years had other female mm -hmm. female performers yeah we were in charge of booking people yeah so, so we so, had other people coming from other states to come to the venues and perform. yeah oh cool have you are you doing stuff mainly here in the bronx or are you doing it no our show was in jersey was well, in jersey, jersey. Yeah. okay we had, we had one show mm -hmm. when at the time when i was a title holder for organization which is princess janae place okay um the title that i recently gave up which is mr housing is healthcare Okay. The but the club is sorry. Right. Don't mean to, to interrupt you. That that sounds very important there. The organization yeah. about what what do they do there? You know. Oh, like, um, like, the organization is 
the doors are not closed, but due to funding, mm. um, you know how that works is that when mm. funding is cut yes. and budget cuts and stuff like mm. that, you know, they are looking for more funding, but it's an organization that help people find housing. Yes. Yeah, you okay. know, to find yeah. housing. Yeah. Whether you are trans, whether you're LGBT, whether mm. you're cisgendered, mm. we help you find housing. Okay. Well, Do you yeah. need a house? <laughs> or no? Yeah. Yeah. So um <laughs> at that time yeah. we were hosting shows at um Boxers, NYC in yeah. the Bronx. Yes. And, no, in Washington Heights. Yeah, yeah. So we hosted a show there for about couple of months while I was the title holder there. We had benefit shows there. Mm -hmm. We had a birthday show for Leo there. Um, and then the pandemic hit. Yeah, I was going to ask you, like, how did you guys survive um, that? Like Pandemic hit and Leo basically said, well, let's just do YouTube. Nice. At that time, we just had the separate channels. Leo had his own channel. Mm -hmm. I had my channel. Mm -hmm. And then after that we got those two monetized and then we wanted to basically legalize our business yeah. you know get our incorporation papers um do the website and everything and then mm -hmm. the person that um the website came out beautiful yeah the person oh, that nice. basically um totally said well the guy that did our website he said well maybe you should create a whole another channel for the company yeah. which <laughs> we didn't think of because we was putting everything on both of our Channel. Channel. Yeah. yeah, so that's how House of X Entertainment um, became. Went we from a drag first, house to yeah. like a virtual entertainment. Yeah, yeah. virtual oh, entertainment nice. company to where now we actually have the channel together. Mm -hmm. We do almost like everything. vlogs. We do everything. interviews, vlogs, traveling. Yeah. I've, I've we also oh, got God. Um, four to five awards off of YouTube. Mm -hmm. Because um, other content creators noticed what we were doing and they were having an award show. So we actually got to win some awards along the way. So sure, that was really sure cool. award acclaimed. <laughs> that yeah, was nice. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. So, like, how was that transition from, you know, being around so many people mm -hmm. and, you know, connecting, bonding? You know, it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's a very strong community that you guys were building mm -hmm. to now being just two of you in a house together. Mm -hmm building a community again for like, me it was fun because yeah. it strengthened me and watson's chemistry together nice you know what I mean um because now we're stuck in the house and can't go anywhere so now you have to work together and you're still married so it made everything stronger with us yeah, yeah. especially when you know your spouse and you know what they're good at they know what you're good at so it makes for good chemistry yeah nice. a lot of people say that you know spouses can't work together or it's hard mm -hmm. for spouses to actually work together yeah well, I disagree because as long as you know your spouse, you know them when you sleep with them, you know them mm -hmm. when you lay down with them and when they mm -hmm. wake up, you know that if they yell at you, that's just strictly business. Okay. <laughs> after, <laughs> okay. after yeah. um, you know, five o'clock or mm -hmm. nine o'clock mm -hmm. past, depending on what time your mm -hmm. schedule is for that particular work, yeah. then you should know, okay, it wasn't meaningful. It was just mm -hmm. because they're trying to get their point across. So you guys had to sit down and figure out your boundaries, which is yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, you know what it is for yeah. me. I know what Wanson's good at. I mm -hmm. know what his focus is. Yeah. I know how to pick his brain and what his ideas were. Mm -hmm. Me, anybody who met me, I'm very laid back, very silly, very you know, yeah. life of the party. Yeah, my time. husband's a whole lot more serious yeah. than I am. So working <laughs> on YouTube. Mm. It was like, okay, I'm going to have to turn my personality up a little more okay, so that I'm not coming off seriously because when you're on YouTube, you want to be serious, but you want to have fun, but you know, you want your lighting to be correct. You want mm. your mic to be working. You want mm -hmm. everything to be done. And I was like, okay, I'm going to have to play off of Watson's personality and come mm. together because he'll, if you're too serious, he's not going to do it. Okay, yeah. Okay. So I had to make sure that I was just like, everything was a joke. Because we had moments where like the camera would fall and the people thought it was funny. Now, for me, I would normally take that seriously. It's mm -hmm. like, okay, I, this is not what I want, but I just played everything off because I knew it was like, okay, if this becomes too serious, he's not going to do it. So everything yeah, just became yeah. a yeah. joke yeah, when so, we were doing it. Yeah. Like, so compromise there. Yeah, right? and, the, and yeah, also, cool. like, in the past, yeah. and Leo still says mm -hmm. it today, people, when we were doing the shows <laughs> in Trenton, New Jersey, and even here in Washington Heights, mm -hmm. they used to call me the boss man. I'm not really the boss <laughs> man. It's just I like... Ch Teddy's the boss. I'm yeah. not. <laughs> I like... I'm, I'm the CEO, but he, he's man. Yeah, I yeah, like yeah. structure. And yeah. Everything has to be organized. It has to make sense because mm -hmm. I did go to school for business. So yeah. if this is not organized, mm -hmm. I'm like, we're not doing it. 
Yeah. No, I, I totally know? understand that. So um, I used to have a way like, okay, we need to show up on time because this is our show. And if we're late, we look mm-hmm. unorganized. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, we need to be there when the place is open. We have mm-hmm. to set up. So it's I been fun. It's been always fun had like a, um, a time schedule. Yeah. Yeah. You know, even with the performers, like you need to be here at a certain time. If you show up at this time, you're not performing. No. Yeah. You know, so it's yeah, like yeah. I always had that way. And then people will say, well, he's the boss man, even <laughs> though they both of them run the show. Okay. I mean, um, well, also the, go through ahead. YouTube, we got um, a theme song for the yeah. channel. Nice. So House of X has an official theme song yeah. that you can download. Okay. <laughs> yeah. It can be your I'll, I'll put all links below, guys. I got you. <laughs> so, like, now we're out of it again. Um, where, what direction do you see House of X going? I mean, are you guys going to go back to more social events? Are you guys going to stay on? I know you're going to stay with the YouTube. That's, yeah. that's your bread and butter now. Mm-hmm. You guys seem really comfortable there. I've seen a couple of interviews that you guys yeah. have thrown. Like you, you are very welcoming, and people love talking to you guys very, very much. Hopefully I see that. Life for the yeah. party. <laughs> I know what I mean. I life yeah. for the party. Right. I want to say we're going to do both. Yeah. Okay. The yeah. reason I say that is because you have to do both. The world okay. is open back up again, mm-hmm. and there's a whole bunch of people that don't know you. Yeah. So you have to go outside and introduce yourself mm-hmm. all over again. Yeah. Um, yeah. Online is cool. I tell Watson this. I don't like chains, so I'm very comfortable just chilling online because it yeah. helped in so many areas. It's like, okay, this to me is fine for me. Yeah. yeah. Outside, you have to table. You have to bring things with you. You have to reintroduce yourself, reintroduce your brand. So it's mm-hmm. a lot more work. Yes. Um, yeah. So for us, we're ready to do that, or we're getting ready to do that because Watson has a book out, and I'm working on a comic book. So we're adding to our resume. So then, when we do come back outside to rebrand everything, it's more that we have to offer. Yeah. Okay. But we're also doing it now too because I would say going to Comic Con mm-hmm. at NYC and then uh, for the cons that we have been to now, it mm-hmm. gave us more exposure. Yeah. Because at the time when COVID had came. Mm-hmm. We were just virtually known yeah. on social media. Yeah, I mean, you guys have a pretty solid following. Like yeah. again, I've seen like like people are excited. Like whenever whenever you have a, a guest on your show, they're very excited. They're very like hyped to talk to you. You know, like sometimes when you do these interview shows, you get those people like, uh, yeah, <laughs> just do this. Yeah. Thing. So yeah. now going to the other events, mm-hmm. and we're actually giving someone the platform to speak on mm-hmm. and introducing ourselves to mm. who we are to mm. them yeah. it's given us a more broader standpoint yeah. and a bigger platform to get the company's name out there okay question so like what do you see in the community right now like are you enjoying the shape of our community right now of, of uh, the bronx new york city like do you feel like what you're going after I mean, for the company, mm-hmm. House of X, do you see it in our community? Is there anything we need to readjust? Or you like the direction that we're going with right now? Sorry, this is deep conversation. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> all good. It's yeah. all good. <laughs> I, just, I, just, I just usually um, ask this of our guests. I don't, you know? I don't really see, yeah. like, there's, a, I would say, in our community as an entertainment mm-hmm. company or mm-hmm. folks that may help someone master mm-hmm. their social media mm-hmm. like one of our goals is to actually i would say come out of our home office mm-hmm. and go yeah. public mm-hmm. to where we actually mm-hmm. have a studio where you can come if you don't know how to physically do your social media or your youtube you can come in Wait, what do, a bell did i tell you <laughs> do your video yeah um we can actually do our interviews and from yeah. that particular studio okay. and then even start performing again okay. in that particular building as well. So that's one of our main, main, main goals. Yeah. So you're going to go back and do, you're going to throw events again, like, well, sorry, we're recording this right now in like June. Yeah. So are you looking to do stuff more in the summer or fall? Cause we also like to network. That's mm-hmm. the main goal mm-hmm. of, of Tokyo Bronx. Yeah. So we, we want to make sure like when people are like, Hey, I'm looking for this type of event. I'm looking at this social event, you know, House of X Entertainment comes up, yeah. you can send them your direction. Absolutely. So absolutely. Like, so we have, it's an end of works, but the company so just, is going to be mm-hmm. five years when our marriage anniversary mm-hmm. is yeah. coming around. Okay. Yeah. So we Congratulations. Been, thank you. Yeah. So we are planning to mm-hmm. do a public event. 
where mm-hmm. you actually get to see performers and other folks that we have had on mm-hmm. the show mm-hmm. um, live seeing, and we are thinking of inviting other folks that we have worked with and interviewed with to come and also table at the particular event. So that will actually be where we actually go public rather than doing a celebration on social media. Yeah, we got to meet yeah. a lot of different people on YouTube. Singers, rappers, producers, artists. So when it is time to do events, we have our context that yeah. we can come and bring. Also, yeah. provide, cool. you know, so like I said before, thing. guys, I'm just going to leave their information down below. Make sure to follow them. And usually how I and wrap the show up is like, like, again, do you have like a quote or a saying that you live by they can share with people so they like, you know, something positive that help people to find, you know, you never know who's watching the show. And they're just like, man, you know, I feel um, like I connect with these guys. You know, we normally say we stay entertaining because that's what we do 90% <laughs> yeah. of the time. Nice. It's yeah. entertaining. You stay entertaining. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's beautiful, man. That, and that's how the song is. It's yeah. We stay and yeah. as together as marriage, we also say team in it to win it. Mm. And the. Yeah. The slogan or the motto for the company is X marks the spot. For greatness. Mm-hmm. For greatness. So mm-hmm. behind it is uh, for s- those are biblical readers or Bible readers mm-hmm. out there. If you know. You're reading your Bible. If you know. <laughs> the, um, yeah, Muslim. Yes. <laughs> if you know the scripture that says yeah. with God anything is possible, mm-hmm. that's basically what it means. Okay. All you right. know, so X marks the spot. With, if you trust in God, that's basically what it means. All right, cool. And do you guys have anything coming up that you like people to know about or to follow? Um, besides that, if yeah. you haven't been on a cruise and you like to go on a cruise, we are hosting a, a group cruise, which is March 17th to the 23rd. Um, it will be Leo's 40th birthday. Job, um, so you can inbox us on Instagram for all the information. We'll direct you to our travel agent for that. Um, and yeah, you'll find us every mm-hmm. almost every weekend on YouTube for yeah. whatever show. At Tell them where to find you on everything, right? House now. of so X Entertainment. Yeah. House of X Entertainment. Yeah. On every also, platform. Yeah. If okay. anybody out there wants to interview, do reach out and contact us. We don't mind interviewing. Yeah. Um, that's what we do. Is there a particular subject, or they can just be interviewed about whatever? As they, long as they have um, a story to tell. Yeah, See, our there we go. There we go. Open yeah. To yeah. Okay. Open to and you yeah. have a story. We've had so. organizations on there. Mm-hmm. We've had trans people, gay people, singers, rappers, artists. Yeah, the platform is fantastic. It's open to anyone. Because everybody has a voice and it's yeah. to be told. And we believe in that too. All right. Thank you guys. I appreciate this. And that's it, guys. That is the wrap to the chat. I appreciate you guys for coming through. Thank you for coming to our space. Thank you for blessing us. Um, You've got to sign the wall behind you before you leave as well. So thank you so much. And again, akuna matata, guys. Have a good day. Bye.